This is for Sagittarius, sub so rising and Venus signs. This is for Sagittarius. My name is the reader of the million dollars here for those of y'all that are new and welcome to the million dollar channel. What's going on, everybody? All right, y'all, let's see what's coming in for Sag right now. So we do got moonlighting. So we're going to start off with your career. You can start working your dream career part time while you work your other job to pay the bills. And we got quiet retreat. So we have, it's time to disconnect yourself from your outer world so that you can focus on your inner world. And we also have attracting, not chasing. I think this is going to be extremely important for Sagittarius. So anything or anyone that you chase will run the other way because of that underlying fear of chasing energy. And then we also got obstacles and blocks are lifted. So this is for those of you that feel like there's something stopping you from moving forward. So we have all your good personal work and your positive energy have overcome previous obstacles and blocks are lifted away. You are now experiencing progress and forward movement with your projects. And we also have face your financial fears. So this is for those of you that are afraid because maybe you are, you know, going through some type of financial struggle and wanting some type of compensation. And we also have successful funding. So we have your ideas divinely guided and supported by the same infinity wisdom of God that gave you the idea. During, do not allow money concerns to prevent you from turning into reality. Crowdfunding partnerships and other investments are available to you now. And we also have block out distractions. So we have your life purpose and other priorities need your undivided attention. So it's time for you to take charge of your schedule, your working environment by turning off electronics or avoiding anyone or anything to distract you from what's important. And we also got donations, tithing, and charitable work. So I see you could be giving back to communities, giving back to organizations. Always remember Sagittarius, these readings are donation-based. So if y'all would like to continue to see readings for Sagittarius, then make sure you send in for Sagittarius. And we also got raise of promotion. So we got congratulations. And increasing your abundance flow awaits you. This is a result of your positive focus and willingness to take the steps that you're being divinely guided to take. Keep up the great work. And we got some Leo energy here. So today's Sagittarius' match is going to be Leo. So we have positivity, faith, and optimism. You open the doorways to positive experiences with your positive expectations and energy. Do not allow negative energy or temporary setbacks to inter path with the, interfere with the path that you are on. And we also have severe vows of poverty and clearing death. So for a lot of my Sagittarius, it's just self-care involves removing any heavy burden of emotional or even financial debts from your life. Or even somebody, maybe this could be somebody's energy that's, you know, kind of pulling on yours. So keep that in mind too. Let's see what else is coming in right now. So we do have the Angel of Enlightenment. Somebody could be 33. And we also have the Angel of the White Light. So something is coming to light here. And we got the Angel of Truth. So somebody can be 30. For a lot of my Sagittarius, this is the truth coming out about your situation. A lot of you have been asking the universe for the truth anyway. So it looks like this is now happening. So we got the Angel of Good News. So this could be a phone call, a text message, or email. Somebody can have a 14-year-old. We got the Angel of Manifestation. This is something that you manifested finally happening. So this is a house, a job, a car, an apartment. Whatever this is, trust the process. This is working for you. I love this energy for you, Sagittarius. What else is coming in right now? So we do have the angel of healing. So I'm seeing a lot of y'all trying to heal. You could have a guardian angel coming to see you. You know, I am am getting that this could be a feminine energy. And then for some of y'all, we also got the career angel. So you could be changing careers or changing job paths very soon as well. You could even be going into business for yourself. So just keep that in mind too. Let's see what else is coming in right now. So we got the angel of romance, and then we also got the angel of friendship. So this could be starting off as a friendship and going into a relationship, or this could be a relationship turning into a friendship because maybe both of you came to the realization that this, you know, relationship isn't meant to be and that y'all should kind of just focus on yourself. Take what energy resonates once again, of course, and leave what does it for somebody else. Let's see what else is coming in for Sage at the moment. So we do got the chakra balancing angel. Somebody got 15 year old and we got the angel of strength. Somebody got four year old. We got some Leo energy here. A lot of Leo energy showing up. This is the universe telling you to 
balance your chakras and to balance your energies and to protect your energy at all costs. And we also got the parking angel. Some of y'all could feel stuck. Some of y'all could feel parked. A lot of my Sagittarius are like, the universe parked me. Well, they parked you for a reason. It was something that you weren't paying attention to or it was something that you needed to see that you weren't seeing. So we got to level up. They parked you so that you can focus on moving up in life. And we also got liberty. So I am seeing things balance out for you, even if you don't see it for yourself. We got letting go in the bodega cat. So this is letting go of the past. And this is focusing on the future and what's pretty much ahead of you right now. And we got the portal. So there's a new door opening up for you, Sagittarius. But you got to see that for yourself. And we got the messenger. So you could be receiving a message from spirit about the next path in your life very, very, very soon. So trust the process. And... We also got the crossroads. So this is pretty much letting you know, Sagittarius, that your situation can go left or right. It's up to you which way it goes, though. You have all the determination within yourself. And we also got the community. So I am seeing for a lot of my Sagittarius, is you know, working among a group of people is also going to be a thing for you. And we got anything that's possible. So there's so many doors that can open for you right now. But you kind of just got to trust the process. And we also got what goes around comes around. So everything that you are putting out, Sagittarius, is exactly what you are going to receive in return. So just know that as well. We got projections and then we also got in between. So some of y'all are feeling stuck in a situation. There's a lot changing for you. There's a lot getting better for you throughout time. What else is coming in for Sag at the moment? My name is D Reader to me and all the Terry for those of y'all that are new. So we do have goodbye to the old and hello to the new. And to whom do you need to forgive? So in order to get to a place of being able to let go of the past, you got to forgive this person and let go of what happened. And we got perfect timing. So this is the right time to move forward. And we got birthday because we are in Libra season right now. Happy birthday to all my Libras. I'm a fellow Libra myself. For those of you that did not know, my birthday is on Monday. October the 14th, so make sure y'all mark y'all calendars, but they're wanting you to let go of something before your birthday because Sagittarius season isn't far. So we got in, express your individuality and we got your son is being watched and protected as he explores the world. So some of you, maybe you could be holding some resentment towards your son. Your son could be holding some resentment towards you. And we also got be yourself and business ventures. So I do see you taking a leap business-wise. I do see you stepping out on faith business-wise. And we got holidays. So the next following holiday is Halloween. So some of you could be doing a grand opening or some type of promotion or sale for Halloween. And then some of you could be, you know, launching your business around that time. For those of you that are wanting to launch a business, do some research on what you're trying to actually do. Now, for some of you, I am seeing as far as your love life, the universe is telling you to be assertive and stand for what you want. And and to stand for what you believe in. Let's see what else is coming in for Sage right now. And always remember, Sage, these readers are donation based. So if you're wanting to continue to see content for Sagittarius, then don't forget to send in for Sage, y'all. I do see a high priestess. This could be you. This could be the person that you're dealing with, water sign, because we do got the medicine mother. So I do get a water sign, feminine energy vibe, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Some of y'all could be dealing with her right now. And then we also got the summer. So we got basking, joy, and light. And then we got the guardian angel. So y'all could have got a visit from your guardian angel back in the summertime about something that is starting to happen, you know, right now. And we got the great teacher. So we got to learn from this spiritual experience. So that could be what's going on for a lot of you. And then we also got the stat. We got trust and thrive. So that's going to be important for Sagittarius as well now, especially for those of y'all that are ready to go down a different path. A lot of y'all are ready for something different. So if you are, then this is kind of your chance. What's going to be the final message? So we got the earth guardian, stay rooted and grounded. And then we got the air guardian. We got shift your perception. So some of you could be dealing with an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Some of you could be dealing with an earth sign, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. But this is the universe basically telling you right now at this moment to shift your perception on your situation. So just keep that in mind. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment, y'all. For those of you that lost your father, maybe tapping into your spirituality can be your way to communicate with him. I appreciate you, Sag. Thank you.